Hey, what's going on everybody? Victor here. Uh, just wanted to connect again and share what I will be doing today. It's Sunday, which is always a great day to go out to the flea market. It's about an hour from where I live. And right now my wife's dropping my son off with his grandparents. But I wanted to play a fun, quick game with myself. I think it's something that I should always do uh, moving forward. But I'm playing a game in my head called Transforming 20s. I'm going to take $20 with me. Uh, that's primarily used to buy items I think I could resell or flip to gain some profit. Uh, and with each of those items, I'm hoping that I can either double or triple my profit based on what I find at the flea market. A lot of these vendors know what they have. Uh, some might not. So I'm hoping to find some comic books, find some toys, uh, maybe find some cards that I can easily take, flip, and make a little bit of profit off to buy some of the things I want to get. Um, I'm probably gonna bring more than 20 to buy the other things I see that I'm looking for But today it's transforming 20s $20. Let's see how much of a profit we can get. I'll let y'all see how that goes. Bye Hey everyone, I'm back. Uh, I actually didn't record while I was in the flea market I decided not to because of COVID having to wear a mask background noise I wanted to make sure that I had everything clear sound and able um, back in the car waiting for some sushi to get finished uh, so I could take the drive back home I got like 50 minutes to get back um, but like I said $20 challenge I, I think I went overboard I'll let you all be the judge but I did end up spending $24 on the items I think I could flip um, and then I bought myself a boatload of Pokemon cards that I've been sitting here opening uh, but that's that we'll get rid of those uh, so what did I buy let's grab the first two items First thing I had is this Gyarados Hollow from XY Evolutions. Got that for $5. Uh, should be able to make 12 so uh, double my profit. Send it with a plain white envelope and be able to get that mailed for $0.50. Cents. Then I have a Reverse Rare Zapdos. Um, should be able to sell that. Let's see if this gets some focus going. Uh, should be able to sell that for 10 too. Also grabbed it for 5 uh, so two cards, $10, should be able to make about 20 uh, But now we'll go to the comic books. So here I got uh, some good deals. Oh, you can see them both. But the first ones were Batman, Detective Comics, 734. Second appearance of Cassandra Kane. I've been trying to collect uh, all the books of my uh, people of color in comics. Cassandra Kane is one of the members on that list. Um, so I'm going to keep going with that. Got it for $2. Average sales looking like it's 12 to 15 bucks on eBay. So again, five times my money back on that. Uh, and then I have Hawkeye 10, which is the first appearance of Clown. Uh, again, this is going anywhere between 10 bucks and $25. So I'll see what I'll be able to get. This is actually my second copy of this. So I could get rid of this one. Why not? The goal was to see what I could flip. And lastly, I was able to get a stack of Secret Invasion. We know that Disney Plus is talking about their uh, release of the show uh, at home. Maybe I'll show it to you all. But I have a copy of this, which is a 9.8. I found that a few weeks ago in New Hampshire, went into this random comic book store the week that the show was announced, and I was able to grab a 9-8 copy for $75 cash. No tax, because I was in New Hampshire. Um, but I do have Secret Invasion 1 through 7. Um, the guy didn't want to give me it for less than 10, and I thought it was a deal. Um, I'll go back home, I'll press a few of them. Some of them have some spine ticks and creases, but with that, I should be able to make more than double the money so if we think about ten dollars maybe thirty if I'm lucky that'd be twenty dollars I spent ten on the Pokemon cards which will again double uh, give me ten more dollars in profit so that should be forty dollars in profit uh, and then with the clown and Cassandra Kane books oh sorry glare uh, clown and Cassandra Kane books I should be able to make some more money um, so then again invest in the things I want like I tell you all my philosophy is buy sell trade make sure you can buy things at a low cost sell them at a higher and make sure you can pay for what you want later on uh, and I, again I'll dabble in anything Pokemon cards comic books Funko Pops I didn't find any because the gentleman at this flea market they decided to scan their eBay app right in front of me to then give me a price when I said what's your price uh, which is okay. They went fair market, but do your work if you're gonna set up a shop and sell some things Make sure you don't see your customer See you get your prices online and not even give you a deal like you're taking percentages away from me 
So whatever. I'm not even going to deal with that. I think it's crooked. But um, let's see what I could do. Maybe I'll give you all the recap on Instagram. Remember, like, subscribe. I'm really getting hungry. I need to go get some sushi. But I appreciate you all watching this. I'll talk to you later. There's more. All right, y'all. I got a quick update. I know I just did the, let's see what we're going to do with this $20 thing. Um, left the flea market, had some good sushi. And then I decided to stop at a comic book store on the, the way back. And when I go in there, uh, me and a few other people know about this spot. We know that there's a few copies, back issues of hot books. So I went in and I lucked out. Um, I got a stack right here. Let's see what we got. You know, something is killing the children. Eight. We got something is killing the children. Nine. First print. We got something is killing the children. Nine. Second print. I got something is killing the children. Ten. First print. I got something is killing the children. Ten. Second print. Um, and then some of the newer ones. We got 11. 12. 13. I can add these all to the, the stock that I have at home. I have some of the earlier issues. I just got rid of two issue number threes for $40. Um, they had stack bends, they had spine ticks, but someone paid me 40 bucks for two. I got them at cost. Uh, and then the last book I was able to get is the Spider-Man number 18. Um, I know y'all seen this being hot lately, so just peek that up in here. Um, but I think today was a good day between the flea market deals and the uh, comic book shop deals on the way back home. Really excited to see what happens with something that's killing the children because we all know it's a hot series. Um, but I was too excited not to throw this onto this video. Um, so yeah, th this has been fun. Remember, the, the, my big goal is to just enjoy some of these books, um, but mainly to see what I could flip. Again, um, there are some bigger, better books that I'd like to buy for myself, put them in my collection, but also it's a good hobby that keeps me uh, out there moving books. Uh, so thank y'all for being here. Um, sorry, I, had, I couldn't end the video. I couldn't end the video the way I did it last time. Um, so yeah, check it out later. I'll talk to y'all soon.